the nipple is the equivalent of balls itch. Tell me please. Boom, boom. Tell me please. Is it the same? And why do these nipples itch? Answers on She Gets It. Coming up. When you mind in all your business and your nipples start to itching, reach down in the shirt and scratch your way out the irritation. Jesus! It be feeling so good when you scratch your nipple. But it's so hard to remind yourself that, hey, hey you, hey sis, we are in an office. And everybody can see you. Or if you at the cash register and you scratch a nipple. Or if you um, on Zoom and you scratch your nipple because it's the instinct that, oh, I'm itching right here. Let me get it. But you're scratching your nipple and everybody can see you. And your nipples are obvious. Is the nipple itch equivalent to the man itch? Because I feel like... Men have no problem groping themselves in front of you in conversation in an office. They have no problem fixing their balls when their when their junk starts to itch and they just go ham and it's like regular. It's accepted. So can women's nipple itch also be accepted? Can we reach down in our bras? And sometimes when I did work in the office, I would reach into my shirt and just like cup my tit i don't know if that's comforting to any other women but that's comforting to me and my god is a good god and he wouldn't want me out here dry with my breast being uncivilized so i'm scratching and that's what i'm talking about this episode (laughs) let's get into her foolery on she gets it Side note, y'all gonna have to bear with me. I think I think I'm gonna have to double down and get me a motherfucking new laptop because the drivers on this motherfucking HP. Side note, y'all have the worst customer service in life. Just because y'all make a laptop and y'all don't make it anymore, y'all basically cut off all help on that shit. So I, if the drivers on my laptop are not recognizing none of my mics i have two mics and it's not recognizing none of that shit so it'll work sometimes and then it won't work and don't tell me to troubleshoot it by uninstalling the drivers and reinstalling or updating the shit i tried it it said it's perfectly updated so it just boils down to the fact that the shit broke so yes i am back to recording through my phone so if the audio is not as pristine as y'all used to on a regular degular with your girl Shan, I apologize. But um, I'm going to have to buy me a new laptop. And do I want to buy a laptop right now? No. Did I already spend some money on my birthday gift that's on June 4th? Yes, I did. Was it a laptop? Hell no, it wasn't. So if anybody can help the girl... <laughs> Please email me. Please let me know. DM me. Like, what the fuck is up with these drivers and why won't it recognize my mic? And I don't want to take it to the motherfucking Yeek Squad and then tell me, yeah, you know, the drivers are just bad. But can you pay us for looking at your laptop? No! If the drivers are bad, I would like for somebody to be like, okay, the drivers are fucked, sis. Yes. You're going to have to buy a new laptop. It's time. It's that time. And let me tell you something. I'm sorry that this turned into a rant. I am going to talk about y'all crusty ass nipples soon. Let me tell you something. Ain't nothing worse than being an adult and paying motherfucking bills and getting things that you want and turning around and buying something because the motherfucker just won't work. The nerve. The audacity. Shit. But let's get into this show because (laughs) this is not what we came to do. This is not what I came to do. But I just needed to get that off my chest. So let's start talking about these breasts. (laughs) 
Y'all know I like to have fun with y'all and I'm all for the jokes and shit. But all seriousness, any man or woman experiencing skin on your breast or nipple area getting a little bit thick, a little bit hard, go to the doctor because it could possibly be a rare form of breast cancer called pageant disease. And I don't want anybody out here with thickened skin on their breasts and thinking it's just ashy. No, it's beyond ash at this point. Go have your doctor look at that boob, okay? Because I want you to keep your boobs. You want to keep your boobs. And we want you to be healthy. With that being said, let's get into my foolery. Nipples can be dry, irritated, you know, by your bra or if you already have a dry skin, period. Some people have eczema. Some people have um, allergies that are weird. If you're breastfeeding, it's very important for you to clean in your nipples, especially so your ducts don't get um, blocked. I'm not talking about the quack quack. I'm talking about the nipple opening that actually gives the child milk. Sometimes your man, because he's nasty. <laughs> and I mean, are you pregnant? Was the brown liquor hitting that one night and you can't remember about the night? I mean, did he shoot up the club? Okay, I'm just saying you might want to go pee on that stick because nipple itch can be a lot of things. And I don't want y'all thinking like, oh my God, I need to go to my doctor's because my nipples are itching. No, sometimes your nipples is just dry because you take showers often. A lot of y'all don't lotion y'all bodies. I don't know why because I like feeling my skin moisturized and you should too. Nipple itch can also be from allergies. Some people are allergic to certain fabrics like polyester, lace. I know my coochie does not like lace, but your nipples are definitely not your coochie. But I mean, maybe your nipples are irritated by lace bras. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you're wearing a lot of... Um, anti-breathable fabrics and your nipples is just like sis release us release us okay that could be a factor and men please remember slight caressing of the breast can be the best let me say that one more time slight caressing of the breast can be the best okay <laughs> Like, y'all be tug-of-warring with our nipples like they not attached to us. They attached to us. It's not Velcro here, sir. I'm going to need you to release. Release the nipples. They don't belong to you. Treat the nipples with respect. Y'all be tug-of-warring with those hoes, okay? Chill out. You can moisturize your nipples. Don't be afraid of a little moisture on the nipples, okay? You can use some CeraVe cream um it's not like it doesn't come with a strong scent it's a little bit thick it rubs in okay you won't see it okay you can use almond oil which is good for your skin you can use vaseline on your nipples like keep them hoes moist like if you treat your nipple right your nipple will treat you right be nice to the nipples the nipples didn't do shit to you and they're going to do shit for you, like give you the best sensations if such and such is doing what he's supposed to do. Okay? Also, another thing, women. PMS can cause your nipples to itch. Yes. You can have PMS before Shark Week. And you can have PMS after Shark Week. And that can cause your nipples to itch. Okay? It's just one of those things that we got to deal with, okay? Men, again, stop being extra rough with women's nipples, all right? Stop pulling them shits. Stop pinching them shits. Like, they don't have feelings. They have feelings. They may not scream, but I will scream for them. They have feelings. Treat them nipples with respect. So, out here, y'all, if y'all was wondering, like, I was wondering why these nipples are itching, because they dry most of the time. But again, if you notice something different about the skin around your breasts, don't think that, oh, it's nothing. Go get your nipples checked, okay? Go get your nipples checked. It's very important. And I just feel like you're going to be happy with your nipples not itching. People are not going to be looking at you strange in public because you're scratching your nipples. And 
everything is going to be, you know, chill. But that's my jits on that nipple itch. Okay? This is your girl Shan from She Gets It Pod. Yes. And I was dead ass serious about anybody that knows what's going on with the driver on a laptop because... The girl is not the geek squad and the girl is not trying to waste her money on the geek squad. So if anybody knows why the fuck these drivers are not working on this HP laptop, let me know. You can hit me up at she gets it pod at gmail.com or she gets a pod in the DMs of Twitter or IG. I appreciate you. You know what I'm saying? I would love an explanation. And if I have to get a new laptop, please just be like, girl, sis. <laughs> You're gonna have to get a new laptop, okay? Just let me know. Let me know because this phone shit. Yeah. I don't wanna keep doing this phone shit if I don't have to. But um yeah, I'm out of here. Don't be letting your nipples get dry. Moisturize on.